You know, I don't like cat puns. They freak me out. <laughs> Welcome to another episode of Why Are These Monsters So Terrifying? And today's monster is Thomas the Train. <sighs> And if you'd like to see more videos with this handsome fellow, make sure you smack that like button. And remember to subscribe if you're new. It's free and I'm Choo Choo. Did I say I'm Choo Choo? No, he Choo Choo. So this is a creature we made and it's, <laughs> this is supposed to be the non-terrifying version. <laughs> But somehow this seems a little worse. Why have we done this? Look at those eyes. This is Thomas and inside of Thomas, I was here. You see, welcome to my cockpit. It's alive. This regular old Thomas has 8,000 health. He's a pretty beefy boy. Mm. And as you can see, he regens health. He is a living train after all. It makes sense. Does it? I don't know. Should we turn him on and see if he's friendly? He is. He's a friendly boy. He loves to chew. Chew. But you get on his bad side and he'll chew, chew, chew on your brain. Would you like to show us your demon self, sir? What if I shoot you a bunch of times? Still friendly? No problem, I have just the thing. Hi, ah, Gerald. Good to see you, lad. Please, Jerry, not me. That's the train, Gerald. The train. Get the train, boy. Ah, excellent. Jerry, you've smacked him enough that he has become... <laughs> Curse Thomas. And Curse Thomas, don't play no games. Curse Thomas gonna eat you. Sorry about that, Jerry. Real quick, cake check. Um, 11 out of 10, methinks. Now let's temporarily turn him off and have a look around this fella. Uh, we can still go in the cockpit. However, in the cockpit now is this enormous booty, me likey. And if we enter inside, oh, oh look at it. Oh, it's so flesh. Hi, oh, there's the old Thomas face. Hi. Hi. Um, and then we can go up through his long neck into... Oh, he stay still. Oh, you do... <laughs> it's hard to get in there. There's his face. Hello. You okay? Remain still for me, would you? There it is. Excellent. Look at those teeth. Did you know Thomas had shark teeth? Well, now you do. He's also got six legs. What does that... Does that make him an insect? And as you can see, he is also regening health and has 40,000, which makes him pretty beefy. And we're going to find out just how strong he really is. But first, let's let him murder me a few times. Over here, sir. Hi. Oh, stab me. Got me with the leg. Got anything else for me? Oh, a munch. Mm -hmm. How'd I taste? That booty's just so gross. It reminds me of a queen ant, you know? Should we, should we, uh, should we change? I, should I, should we make it so that the, uh, <laughs> stop it, please. Should we make it so that he could lay eggs? D is anyone else? Uh, would you like to see that? Co comment egg if you want to see Thomas lay eggs and we can add that. Okay, well, he's incredibly violent, incredibly strong. And where's my fists? No, my... Okay, here we go. Now we can tank him. Hello. As you can see, he's got a few a few little swoops and stabs and, a, and an execute that just won't quit. He fell off. <laughs> That's unfortunate. Are you stuck? Can he take a punch? Well, I hit him in the belly. There we go. He did. Now, before we test his strength against some other creatures, let's see if we can turn him to stone. Starting with you. Oh, oh my. What the dickens? What just happened? Uh, and your turn? Same thing. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's taking a while. It takes a lot longer. And then... <laughs> For some reason, they then just become massive. All right, um, if I remember correctly, these are here forever now. That's good. They look so cool. You know, I've always wondered, what does Thomas deliver? Maybe it's milk. Well, let's see if Thomas has a relationship with milk. Oh, the milk doesn't seem to like the train. Steam, steam and milk, that seems like a bad combination. Uh, who's winning? I can't really tell. He's hitting him in the neck. And I think Thomas is winning. Oh, he's, he's released the meatball. And the meatball is, I think, dead. Right? Yep. Oh, what the... <laughs> he squished him. <laughs> wow, he did the splits, man. That'd kill any meatball. And as you can see, Thomas is regening health, but it's very slow. His regen is pretty slow. Now, if you've ever wondered what happens if a banana crawls up inside a train, well, here we go. Choo choo. Now, this is just regular old Thomas, so I can choo choo around. Looks pretty cool. And if I try to attack, the only thing that happens is choo choo. This Thomas is just too friendly. Curse Thomas, on the other hand, we've got a right swipe. We've got a... Right, then a left, we have a munch. Mm-mm, delicious. And also, I think they run about the same speed, but look, look at the nubbins. Look at the nubbins on the top of the train. Why are they both moving? What? He's so fleshy. You know, if, if it feels even slightly more cursed when you're inside it. Uh, but he does fit under here, which is nice. All right, get me out of there. Now I want to test his ability to burst through things. We have this wall. Will it protect me from the snake? Only one way to find out. Hi, Thomas. You've climbed the wall, Thomas. That seems... <laughs> um, oh, that didn't go to plan. 
What the? What just? What's happening? From this angle, it doesn't even look like Thomas the train. He looks like <laughs> Thomas the blob. Now I know what you're thinking. Joe, please break his bones. It seems like a lot of bones. Well, I provide. Oh, <laughs> I will do that. <laughs> What? His legs have come off. And his wheels, even his wheels are breaking. <laughs> is he okay? How is his face? His face seems pretty sturdy. Um, I, I take it all back. What about the booty? Does the booty change? The booty's pretty firm. Hey, I wonder if we can reveal the Thomas within. With enough, enough tweaks of the bones, oh, the axles, show us the old Thomas. Seems like he doesn't want to reveal himself, but now let's let him roam. Oh, well, I think we've made it worse. Is this more terrifying? Let me know. The wheels is just the best part. Look at the state of this. <laughs> Now there are quite a few creatures that love living in tunnels. We've got Thomas, we got the train eater, regular Thomas, bridge worm and highway worm, who technically don't really live in tunnels, but they look like they should. Now we're gonna have a real quick uh, free for all battle and see who's the strongest, I guess. It's battle royale, but with trains and worms and whatever this is. Place your bets in the comments. Who do you think's gonna win? Me thinks probably the train eater, but I'm not sure. To be honest, it seems like slight chaos. The worms, are, oh, the worms have teamed up, it seems like. Oh, Bridge Worm's dead. And it seems like now Highway Worm's getting it. He's getting it from all angles. Oh, he's bursting with those spiky legs. And now Tom, Thomas is just being real sus over here, whilst these two duke it out. This train eater only has 21,000 health. I think he gained a little bit of health. I think he ate the worm. But Thomas seems to definitely have a health advantage. And I think Thomas should have this. He's really munching on that flesh. Go on, Thomas, give him another bite. Oh, delicious. You know, I, for some reason, I, I feel like we all wanted to see this happen. It just seems, it seems like a logical arc in the story of this channel. You know, he's still, he's still steaming. He, he never turns the train off even though he's become a being. And I think the train eater is about to die. Boy, there we go. All right, Thomas is stronger than the train eater. And this guy don't care. Choo choo, oh, that thing, why does that thing move? Should that thing move? Ah, it's a little, it's a little bit fleshy. Ah, Thomas is sus. Now we need to find out how hard does he really hit? And to do that, we need to eat McDonald's. Lots of McDonald's. So now we have 3,040 health. Let's turn him on and see how much damage he does. Oh my, that was a double whammy. Hey, oh, how much, I think the first one, oh yeah, there it is again. How much damage was it? That's a lot. Wow, he's really getting through me. Holy moly. Okay, well, he just mowed through. 2,000 health like that. Now you may also have wondered, what happens if you stick a Thomas inside of a train eater? Well, you could do it the traditional way. You could do, you could do it like that. And he starts to sizzle and see, he doesn't seem to be enjoying himself all that much in there. Or you could grab him by the bones and stick him inside. What the, what's that? What, what, what just, what's that? What's going on? Look at the size of this thing. Where's the, tr what? He's in there somewhere. Oh my goodness. This thing is gross. What have we done? How have we done? Look at his face. Thomas. I'm so sorry. Oh, that's gross. Where even is the train eater? Is he in here? Oh, there he is. Hello. Poor guy. Now what happens if we stick him inside bridge worm? <laughs> he just becomes really big. <laughs> With his tiny little son. Oh, hey, they kind of look related, don't Thomas? <laughs> what? what the, it's detached. Um, okay. And now the highway worm. It does the same thing, but there's less room under this one. <laughs> what is going on in the sky? Hey, there's a little bridge worm. Now for the final test. Ten bananas versus Thomas. Who will win? Look at these handsome devils. Is that a katana? Shh. Oh, hi, Jerry. You shouldn't, Jerry. No, Jerry, be gone. It's a banana test. Good luck, everybody. Oi. Oh, Jerry's here. Hi, Jerry. Uh, well, uh, I guess you, you're here now, so we can't really remove that one. Um, there's, uh, that's a few, four, five dead. Five left. He seems to be interested only in the Jerry, which is good for the boys. You've got a sword. You should be in. Get in there, man. Use your weapon. There it is. Oh, what a lad. Look at him go. I think I, what's happening? This guy's tactical. Oh, and you, hi. You got the sniper from a distance. You're a genius. What's happened to you? You guys changing guns? You, uh, uh, I wouldn't pull out a crowbar. The grenades? You're hitting him with a cannon. Well, they, 
No one said they were clever. And the final banana? Unlucky. Did I say final banana? Well, technically I am. I'm coming for you, lad. Close. We almost got him, boys. But that's pretty much it for this video. If you've enjoyed it, please smack that like button. And if you want to see more Thomas, subscribe. It's free. And I'm yellow.